Hi, I'm Mary Jane Fox, and it's exciting to be in the field of Catholic evangelization to serve the Lord um, full time in, in this field. And with me is, is a dear friend, uh, another ca a Catholic evangelist, uh, a, a fellow in the labor in the vineyard, serving the Lord and, and reaching out to people by casting the net. Um, Deacon Harold, I'm, I'm so glad that you're in this uh, t wonderful, wonderful, tremendous work of, of Jesus uh, casting the net to men and women. Yes. And yeah, women are, are really the truly the heart of God's love. Mm -hmm. You know, when God first took love and he implanted that love in the male and female made in his image and likeness, that love first took root, first established a home, first formed a foundation in the heart of the woman first. So the woman truly is the very heart of God's love. Even to this day, we say the woman is the heart of the home and the heart of the family. And it's really the Blessed Mother that really shows us what that heart of love, that receptivity and openness to the Holy Spirit and to God's will is really all about. You know, and you're reminding me of what our beautiful uh, former Holy Father, John Paul II, said. Uh, he wrote a beautiful letter to women called Letter to Women, and he says in that letter that Jesus treated women with dignity, with respect, and with love. I know for myself personally, I've encountered Jesus Christ. And when I did, I, my life changed. I now have a life, and a, an abundant life in Jesus. Um, Deacon Harold, let's, let's give a message to all women who are hearing, who are listening right now. You know, what would be great words of hope for them who are searching for healing, who are searching for meaning and truth in their life? Well, and I can speak to that because uh, not too long ago my mom died. And, um, you know, I, I was trying to figure out how to heal from that terrible loss because we were so very close. And it wasn't until I was at Mass and heard the reading uh, of, of Simeon when they brought Jesus to the temple, the presentation. And Simeon said to the Blessed Mother, a source, a source of pierce your own soul so the thoughts of many may be laid there. So I thought, what if I laid my heart and my pain and my suffering in the heart and united that with the with the wounded heart of the Blessed Mother. And when I started to do that is when I could start healing. So I would encourage all the women out there to remember that you are the heart of love. You are the monstrous. You are the vessels that holds life within your womb, within your being, or the potential for life. And so women, embrace your, the heart of love. Uh, allow the men in your lives to serve you and uh, by your beautiful receptivity to the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And I say along with that, I'd just like to invite my sisters, um, those who, who are searching, to call upon Christ from, from your heart. Uh, and we invite you to, to check out our, our website, pilgrimcenterofhope.org. See how we can better serve you. We're here to help you live your vocation to eternity. God bless you.